Oh, look at that, there's a hand. So this is the femur bone, see? The thigh bone. Look at that, look at the little ankle. Oh, Kim, look. All right, we're gonna have to look around for the sex. You see a little peepee? Right now, the battle of the baby bumps. Kim Kardashian plans to reveal the sex of her baby on the season opener of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. So does this actually mean we're going to get full access to the Kimye baby after all? The battle of the baby bumps is heating up tonight. We have Kim Kardashian actually backing away from a promise to keep her baby under wraps. And then there are new reports that Duchess Catherine plans to move in with her parents right after the royal baby is born. So will Kim's thirst for attention be bad for the baby? How will Duchess Catherine keep from raising a royal brat? And what do these two famous moms-to-be really have in common? Well, I figure who better to get those answers from than super nanny herself, Joe Frost. Joe has a great new show. It's called Family SOS with Joe Frost on TLC. And first, I asked Nanny Joe about the reports that Kim Kardashian might take her baby on tour with her boyfriend, the baby's father, Kanye West. I think certainly Kim will be looking at you know, the, the support that she will have with respect to creating that stability and that safety. And I, I don't know if that's something that she'll be doing in the, in the first couple of weeks or even the first month. I, I mean, I think it's, you know, you have these ideals of what you're going to do. And when the child arrives, it's a whole different ball game. It all changes. Yeah. So, you know, I, I think, you know, Kim will make those decisions with Kanye, with her, you know, um, partner. No doubt they'll discuss that. But quite frankly, what you say now and when the baby's born can be two different stories, yeah. you know. So I'm sure she'll make those decisions once she's had the newborn. Here's the thing that may be beyond the control of the parents. Obviously, they're going to have every need that these babies may face taken care of with people waiting on them hand and foot. When you grow up like that, in an entitled way, how do you prevent these kids from becoming big time spoiled brats. You certainly have mm -hmm. seen one or two spoiled brats in, Well, in I think past. it's very different. You know, we're talking about the royal family, our monarchy. Yeah. You know, and there's a certain protocol and William was raised to be, you know, the heir of our throne. It's very different to Kim Kardashian who makes choices to have a reality television show and those choices are the decisions that she makes. Right. You know, and certainly I think that's very different to uh, being born, born into royalty. And, uh, you know, we very clearly saw Lady Diana and Prince Charles show extreme wonderful examples of how uh, their children being born into royalty were still kept very humble with respects to feeling very connected with the people of Great Britain and certainly um, understanding the importance of the virtues that they taught them. And I, I believe there is a big difference there between the two. And that's why they call her the super nanny. Joe could not be more right. Be sure to check out Joe Frost's new show, Family SOS with Joe Frost, Tuesdays on TLC.